Take me out for some hot dogs. Okay, this is a special raw dog YouTube short. A couple months ago, I went to Phoenix. If you're in uh, Melly, stop by. This is good. a fantastic place with very tasty items, you know? Thanks, Fred. That's right. Thanks, Life's too short to eat lousy food. To eat lousy food. food. And with Spanky's Gourmet Grub. Better name, by the way, Spanky's Gourmet, gourmet Grub. Well, I got a special surprise in store. Let's go back to Jernix for a special on Bailey. Split in the bottom. The other ones seem to split so easy. You know? You know, probably about maybe toast a little bit? Yeah. You know, yeah. Like, uh, that, that I find out does the best. Toast these buns a little bit, it comes out really good. Right? So you, you are the meaty bastard. All right, this is uh, a ripper dog. And uh, when we get, so I hear this is going to be the tank dog. Could be the tank dog. I mean, I mean, first of all, you got to see you know, how it's rated. I say this, it's very close, not quite rut hot, but it's very close to rut hot style taste. I think if we toast these buns, it could be a home run. As of right now, probably a double, maybe a triple. If you toast these buns, that'll get a double for a home run. That's my suggestion. All right. You want one with a toasted bun? Yeah, let's do that. Let's do it. Let's do it. Your bun's gonna be All right, Frank. Round whatever <laughs> of our test kitchen, we will perfect the art of your raw dog. Right? I would toast it a little bit more, maybe get a little bit brown on your side. Oh, so you want on the grill? Yes. Okay, all right. I like to see, that's why we're test kitchen, Greg. Yeah. With the New England one, there's something lacking on it. So you wanted butter? Maybe. And I look that much as good. I don't hate that. Hold on, don't hit that whole thought. I'll put it your butt. Okay. Okay. This is the best thing that logo, right? I don't need it. So we're gonna go New England style like a lobster roll. We'll toast both outer ends. I don't think you'll be able to toast that middle. We will satisfy that. Make it extra buttery. We will make it a home run. We will make this a home run. Oh, crap. There we go. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> This be home run status. This one will only find out. All right, try number three for Frank. He toasted the outside of the roll with some butter. He wanted a little less crispy on the dog, and um, you know what? We're hoping for the home run. Here we go. All right, Frank. So, a little less crispy on the dog. Toasted bun with butter. Oh, right now, this, lost, now, lost. now, feel the difference in the bun. This bun feels sturdy, it feels strong. Good bun to dog ratio. Mm. 
Crisp the dog up a little bit more, and this will be perfect. I would say that would be a home run. I'd be proud to call this dog the Frank the Tank. There we go. Like the air, Frank. Thanks for coming, pal. Well, that's how a hot dog is born. You know? Something new, something different. And uh, I would, uh, these guys are a good place, and I hope that they have a lot of success with the uh, Frank the Tank dog, you know? It was an honor that they brought me in to test it out for a hot dog, and, and uh, these pointers will make this hot dog fly out, out of the, fly out of the stadium. It will definitely be a home run. So keep uh, raw dogging, and it's been a special tank, uh, raw dog test kitchen edition. See you later. Take me out for some hot dogs. Get me one that's only plain. No mustard or her ketchup. I'll know what the dog is really about. And it's hope that this is a good one. Maybe a home run or a double. But if it sucks, it will be a strikeout and not worthy of my taste buds. <laughs> Look at that. Not a good roll. That's almost that's like a butt. That almost like the end of the, yeah, the butt of the bread. We called it the dad. <laughs>